What is going on guys? It is Jared, aka uh oh spaghettios. And this gameplay you're seeing in the background is a bit campy to say the least. I wouldn't consider myself camping because when I consider people camping, I consider them kind of sitting in a corner just waiting for people to walk by. But it is kind of patrolling this whole building almost the whole time. So, you know, I mean it's not the best gameplay, it's no rush in gameplay. But it's an okay gameplay, you know. Um I go 30 and 6, my best kill death ratio for free for all, I believe this whole game. I don't think I've gotten under 10 deaths, or maybe I want 30 and 9, yeah. Alright, but anyways, um, as you see I'm using the target finder. Um, the reason why I'm using it is because I saw the career thing and then it said, oh, target finder kills. I didn't have like, I had a few, but not a lot. So I was like, oh, let me get this um, player card. But so after I got 100 kills, I went back and I was like, oh, didn't even unlock anything. Because I was only tier 3, so now I'm like, kind of like, ah, screw it. If I get it, I get it. Because honestly, the, the player card for it is not even nice anyways. I could care less about it. <laughs> it's just a guy, like, with a sight, like, shooting, kind of. But, um, yeah, the other day, uh, um, I think the 22nd, I got my C4 thing, as you see. I'm pretty sure it's my C4 calling card. I love that calling card because I love the C4 in this game. It's better than any other game. Definitely. By far, in my opinion. Um, probably because of the scavenger and the combination of it. It just works so well in this game. And you don't have to press up to take it out or anything like that. So that's always good. Um, also on the 22nd, I, um, it shows how much I don't really use suppressors. I haven't really used suppressors that much in this. I've used it on the PDW. Um, I tried it on the Scorpion also. And I recently took it off my MP7. I thought it was good with the MP7. I mean, it is good with the MP7, but with a little bit of range, it takes too many bullets with the MP7. To kill and that's really that really annoys me so i took it off the mp7 but with this target finder the recoil is increased like crazy it seems like for the mp7 maybe it's because you're not meant to fire long distance probably why but yeah so i haven't really used suppressor that much i just got my uh get 500 kills with the suppressor attachment that was like a couple days ago on the 22nd so yeah um i got my first gold remington also obviously you know a couple weeks ago or yeah i think so Huh, nonetheless, guys, how is everybody doing today? Um, Barack Obama got inaugurated. I don't know how you guys are feeling about that. I'm kind of sketched out to even say this. Not sketched out necessarily. I don't really know the right word. Kind of iffy on saying this because I feel like if it is real, if it wasn't what it seems that it was, then I'd feel bad for the kids. And, of course, if any kids were really killed in that Connecticut Sandy Hook shooting, then I really do feel bad. You know, have a lot of, uh, feel bad for them and stuff. But the facts point prove, the facts are pointing out that that was made up. It was, um, just another reason for the government to inf try to fix, inflict gun control on us. Um, you know, I've seen a video. I mean, yeah, I know people can make things up, but the facts are right in the f our face. You can't make up some of the things that you saw. And it's just really disgusting that you'd think the government would be up to that. I myself. I would never think the government would do that kind of stuff, like, um, even July of last year, but then I, I realized over time, and now I feel like I'm, I, like, no, the government's really, I mean, they're, they're not necessarily out to get us, but they're definitely not on our side as much as I would have hoped and thought that the government would be, you know, there's the Bilderberg group, so much stuff, it's all conspiracies, you know, um, well, This one actually isn't a conspiracy. I'm just wondering. Okay. Alright, now I know. Because my music just turned off. It's because my uh, my Android, my little uh, robot guy just died. Finally, though. It's been a couple days. I was wondering when it was going to go up. And I leave it on sometimes, like, when I'm not using it. I forget to turn it off. But yeah, so I'll just plug it back in. That's what I love about it. It's rechargeable. No batteries needed. Under, like, this camera, which is going to die soon. <laughs> Um, but yeah, um, it's sad that our government would do that kind of stuff, but, I mean, the facts are right there, especially for the Sandy Hook, which I'm gonna call Shady Hoax, <laughs> uh, Damien called it Shady Hook once, and I was like, dude, that's actually a good, uh, name, but, and I thought of Shady Hoax, cause I do believe it was a hoax, it was set up so they can try to take one of our, uh, amendments away, obviously gun control. I don't know this city, uh, this country to turn into a confederate, or not, I don't confederate, um, 
I can't think of like what it what it is, but I don't know. It doesn't look like it's turned into anything good right now. It kind of wears me. But I don't know. I mean, there's a lot of conspiracy theories, so I don't know if it's all true. You know, you never know what's true and what's not. You can hear a million things, and you just don't. You can't like count on one thing to be true. You know. So the thing is. Um, anyways, I'm done talking about that. Um, yeah, so the target finder, yeah, maybe noobish, kind of. But you know what, I, th I think it fared well in this game that you see in the background. I kept on killing that guy with the Captain America emblem over and again. It kind of made me laugh. But yeah, yesterday I got my first uh, C4 triple kill on Nuketown 24-7. And what happened? The theater didn't record it, and I wasn't recording with my HTPR because usually I don't. And they did not. It did not get my triple kill with the with my C4, which would have been the last of my C4 montage. Montage would, yeah, you know. I mean, the multi kill would be better, but C4 triple kill that's fucking great for me. Because usually I get single kills, double kills are are pretty nice too. But yeah, so my C4 montage should be coming out soon. I've just been really busy lately. I mean, every time I get a clip, uh, every time I get like a good gameplay or something, I don't always have my HTTP on. Matter of fact, most of the time now I don't, which I think that's kind of stupid. But then again, I don't think it's kind of stupid. Uh, I know, because I don't want to take up all the room on my hard drive, and then I have to delete the gameplay after, you know. But then again, I can't. I cannot um count. I can't count on the theater in any Call of Duty's because you know what sometimes they just fuck up and a lot of the time they do and that's what happened <laughs> you know it's kind of annoying but it is what it is you know what can you do um so yeah again this gameplay is not great it's just campy campy ish I mean it's more like patrolling the building but a lot of people will say this is camping so I'm not a great player you know I'm using the low kills as you can see but on Nuketown, yeah, they didn't put out Nuketown 24-7 until like 1 o'clock, 1.30 yesterday. I was like, what the hell? I was, I was up at like 10 a.m. thinking that it was going to be on. And didn't come on until like 1.30, so I was kind of irritated about that. But it started out at level, I think, 48 or 49 or something like that. Or possibly even 50. And now I'm level 54 and I'm about to proceed in like a couple matches. I'll be able to proceed, so I'll be third proceed, which is pretty cool. Uh, so excited about that. Revolution comes out, you know, um, on the 29th, and that is four days from now. So I'm pumped for that. Let's go, Revolution. Uh, hopefully it's good. Hopefully it's not a disappointment, like some of the map packs were in previous Call of Duties. But yeah. Um, thank you guys for watching. This is the end of the video. If you liked what you saw, you can subscribe if you want. I doubt that I'm going to get any subscribers for this, but, <laughs> you know, thank you for subscribing if you do. And you can click the like button, too. You know, nobody ever seems to like my videos, so. <laughs> thank you, guys. Anyways, for watching. Thank you for giving me the time of the day. Peace out, guys.